I'm going to do the first oil change on my son's new Hyundai Palisade. This has been shown in other videos, but I wanted to, since we have it on the lift, I thought folks might want a bigger, better view of the underneath of this thing. So we just uh, take off the aerodynamic cover. Pop these guys off. Now the cover should come off. What are we missing? Just pop. Oh, there's one more. Don't forget the one up inside. go so just like everybody else shows we got the filter cap and the drain plug but since we're under here if folks need to see what the underneath of this thing looks like again just for people's reference I'm going to show you the back of the motor here this is an all-wheel drive So as others have shown, the oil comes out like a gush, so we're going to use the plug as a, a limiter on how fast, the, how fast it flows. Don't learn that trick on the Mustangs. 5 liter Mustang. It's a little hot. Mm -hmm. Like we do with the Mustang, you know, you don't let it all the way out. Right. You kind of just let it regulate the flow there with the nut or the drain plug. You can go quite a bit faster now, but I'm trying to. Keep it from falling. Yeah. And to kind of see where this way this is gonna go. The drawback of this method versus the cardboard splash cover is it oil's a little hot on the hand. So maybe the maybe the cardboard method's better.
Yeah, I put an extension on it that way you get his hand out of the oil flow. First oil change after about what, 500 miles? 700. 700 miles. So, yeah, it's pretty dirty for brand new oil to me. I don't know what the breaking oil is, but. So, after, I don't know, 30 seconds, we're down to the low flow. Maybe it's not as dirty as it looked, but. Always been my practice to do an early, early change. All right, we got our 27 millimeter socket on there. Can't really see much with my light. With the uh, Harbor Freight oil bucket, we can reach both the uh, filter drain and the Drain plug at the same time, so we'll let that continue to drip. Yeah, it looks like a filter. Alright, we'll get the O-ring off and put the new one in. Alright, we'll use our pick and get that old O-ring off. Very easy. And the kit comes with the new O-ring. Alright, we'll get the new O-ring, new filters in. it's in the right slot you can tell by the opening and the groove above it is not covered and it's ready to go back on all right just reassemble here it'll be tight on the other end too so. it in until it gets contact and then we'll cook it.
torque it. 25 foot pounds. It's kind of jerky. It might be clicking already. Alright, we're going to drink it back on. Torque to 25 foot pounds. This seems to be the consensus. And you reattach your panel. And you're good to go. Alright. All buttoned up. Just another pass by just for those that want to see what the underside of this looks like without crawling underneath.